Hey, Rev. What I don't understand is why you spend so much of your time, like, drinking with us lowlifes and shit. Know that enemy, my smelly brother. It's easy to hang around with good Christian brothers and sisters, but to do the Lord's work, well, sometimes you have to sit here and enjoy a good beverage with a bunch of sluts and perverts like this fancy lot. Oh, that's cool, dude. That's really deep. Not as deep as I'd like to feel that young trial up there with my Holy Spirit. What? Nothing, son. Just the Reverend thinking out loud. Hannibal, I'm addicted to that medicine you keep giving me to get me on them damn planes. If you don't give me more, I'm going to shove you up Murdoch's crazy ass. Who do you think would win in a battle between the A-Team and MacGyver? Well, the obvious answer would be the A-Team. Because first, there are four of them. And Mr. T or Mr. B.A. Maracas would smother MacGyver's ass with his jewelry. No, what I'm saying is they would each get to build a single weapon, like they do every episode. Musical themes included? Of course. Then they would square off... Could it be in the ring of death? Whatever your drunken heart desires. With this knowledge, who do you think would be victorious? Well, definitely MacGyver. You're shitting me. Hear me out on this one. Given the rules for the ultimate 80s action show battle in a ring of death... Let's say the A-Team takes a 79 Chevy Malibu. Why a Malibu? Why not? Okay. They take the 79 Malibu and turn it into the impenetrable Deathmobile. Armed to the hilt with AK-47s and shit. You know, you're not doing much for your case here. Would you just relax? Even a fucking Death Star had a weakness. I can't wait to hear this. Resume. You give MacGyver a roll of duct tape, his Swiss Army knife, a couple of empty milk jugs, a case of beer... Always important. ...some fertilizer a box of used tampons, and some rubbers, and he could create an alcoholic nuclear blood bomb that would blow the Deathmobile back to the first fucking season. All right, you got me, Tom. That man could create magic with a roll of duct tape. Yeah. You give that crazy son of a bitch a bag of balloon animals, some shaved-off pussy hair, and a tube of KY, he could make you a franny fuck-me doll. Uh, hey, hey, Tom? Yeah, John. I've been striking out lately with the ladies. Do you uh, know what episode that was so I could build one of them uh, dolls? 